Hey everybody, this has got to be about as random a blog as I've, I've made in a long time. I, I, I'm not sure exactly what I want to say, but I've got a feeling that I want to express, and that I first have to preface it with a little background. Um, this is, if you, and if you like my more esoteric stuff, you know, they, hopefully you'll find this interesting, because this, this, this is where it strikes a nerve there, um, and, that's, and I'm really giddy. <laughs> I love this kind of stuff. Um, we, we, there's, there's a forum, and uh, I've been on and off as a participant in that forum, um, mainly because of you know my, my social issues, <laughs> my issues, and uh, and I'm, I'm I'm back there now because I I, I want to, you know they're good people you know they're really good people and I want to you know I want to I want to I want to be here around good people you know so I, I'm back at the forum it's called it's you, you, anybody's curious they can go there softypapa.net I know it I know I know it's kind of embarrassing it's got my your my my one of my user IDs is the name there but but and, but it's just the way it is um, but also there's another forum called the JVlogs forum. And the uh, the JVlogs forum, they're both they're both neither of those forums are very big. There's not a lot of people, um, and, but there's, it's it's a nice little group. But there's the other forum, the, the JVlog forum is relatively new, and it's um, uh, created and managed by uh, uh, one of the moderators and one of the founders. Um, over uh, one of the you know the guys really put it all together. We were initially when the forums came about, there were several people who suggested to me, uh, and, you know, came to me and said, hey, you know, you know, we have some ideas for forums. It, coincidentally three or four people at the same time came forward and said, hey, you know, how, would you, how about a forum, you know, where we can talk about Japan? And I'm, and it was, these four people basically came together and, you know, and, and created this thing, the softypapa.net thing. And there were, I'm probably going to, I don't think I'm going to start naming names because I'll forget people. There were more than four. There was kind of a group of people. But anyway, I'm getting way off topic. But, and, I'm, and, I, and I made a left turn where I should have gone straight. But that's okay. <laughs> Thus is life. So the Softy Papa forum is there, and there's also the JVlogs forum. And right now, over at the Softy Papa forum, we're we're having kind of a discussion about whether to move the forum to the JVlogs forum. The reason being that the Softy Papa forum is is operated off of a, a free um, uh, forum website, and it's great. It works. Everything's fine. Um, but we don't have much control over it because they, it's free, and they don't give us much control. And one of the administrators over there, um, well, all the administrators are really technical wonderful guys, whiz bang guys, but one of them, Peter, he's a programmer, and uh, he has the ability, he has servers, and uh, he's been playing with it, he, he's got he's got server software running on his on his home system, and he can basically support the forum, we'd have full control as a group over, you know, anything we wanted to do with that thing, and so we're kind of talking about it now, the pros and cons of going over, and I've, I've, I basically throw my, my two cents in that, you know, we, we'll move, maybe, you know, that's fine with me, you know, move over it, and if we do move, we'll probably rename it. We'll probably drop the Softy Papa name and be called something a little more generic because we'd like to invite other content creators over uh, to be a part of that. And um, so, but but okay. So now that you've got a little background, there's two forms, right? So I spend my time. I'm kind of coming back out of my out of my shell a little bit. Um, but I spend my time when I have some free time I, at both of them. And I'm my, I'm Lyle's brother in both of the forums. And there's really just a, nobody at the new at JVlogs forum. Just just a handful of people were testing it out. Peter. Posted a post. No, I forgot it. He posted a post just a while ago today, and I think it was in the in the intro section. I think it was hubba hubba or something like that. That was the. T I can't get it right. Something like that. And I looked at that post, and it was the most random thing. Just photos, and uh, so it had some music in there, and this really detailed. Um, uh, what, do you, what, do you, what do you call it? Uh, terms of service or something? Terms and conditions at the bottom. If you read it, it was really funny. It was great, but it wasn't over the top funny. It was uh, you, you couldn't be sure. Is it serious or is he pulling our legs? And that I think that's what got me. I think it was those terms of service. You know, because I couldn't. I was li left in this limbo world of what, what, what is he doing here? Did, 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 did something funny just happen here, did, or was that serious? Or well, and then you read a further. Wait, wait, was that that was funny? Wait, 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 no, that was serious. Or is it funny and serious? I don't know. And then the pictures, and, the, and then I didn't realize there was music until I heard the headphones making a tinny noise, and I put them on. Wait, there's music, and it all jibed together. And I felt composed, compelled just to write a response back to uh, Peter, basically saying, "I love this post. You know, nice terms of service." And and I threw in a GERD photo, you know, and then I then I started walking out. Um, I walked down to get some soda for the girls, and uh, get a beer for myself. I'm going to go to the supermarket and get it. And I was walking along, and I was thinking about what is it about Peter's post that really nailed me? And I, re I realized what it was. It had the ran a randomness to it that really, really 
hits me hard in terms of uh, it touches something really deep inside me. It's the kind of thing there's, I've talked about him several times. He's been dead, you know, roughly 20 years. Eric Fong, a uh, really good friend of mine. He had that kind of, uh, and, and Peter kind of reminds me of Eric in a way, in a way, kind of a, and I hope Peter won't feel uh, uh, you know, offended by this, but it kind of like a mad genius. I mean, really, I know that Peter is 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 brilliant, and 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 he's and um, he's and, and also esoteric and uh, unique and one of a kind and uh, and, and 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 nice and uh, just all kinds of things. I could say a lot of these same things about a lot of the guys in in, in the forum, and that's probably why I'm you know I'm 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 so grateful for their for you know their their company as well as so many other people. Even though I've been I've been so antisocial lately, doesn't mean that I don't appreciate people. Sorry about that. While I was talking to you, suddenly Emily's appear face appeared on the screen, and she uh, called me up to ask me to buy some tea. So I'm going to do that. So uh, it's probably good she stopped me. Although I just go on forever. Anyway, I just wanted to say thank you, Peter, for that posting that 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 post. Something about it that really really touched a nerve and brought back a lot of pleasant memories of my time with my good friend Eric. And you remind me of Eric in so in so many ways. And I mean that in in the, as, as a most sincere and high compliment. I mean, there's a few people in this world that have that. Um, it moved me as much as as, as, as Eric Evan. Yeah, and, and, and I think you're like you're like that in a way. You're you're an inspirational guy, an interesting guy, a humble guy, and uh, a fascinating man indeed. And so, any of you who've, who've t taken time to watch this, I mean, I invite invite you over to either of the or both of the forums. You know, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if we're going to move over, or we're going to stay to the other one, or we're going to operate both. I mean, maybe the the J Vlogs forum can it will become a place where for J Vlog content creators. Maybe the Softy for Papa forum will stay on its own, or maybe we'll just move all over there. I think it's best to have it all consolidated in one place. I've been hesitating to say this because I, I, I feel like I'm, I, 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 I don't know, I just don't want to make, because the guys that made the Softy Papa Forum, um, you know, uh, that really, that, that, that started, that they actually did, created it, you know, created the account and everything like that, I don't want to, you know, take away from their work. I mean, they made a lot of hard work there, so moving would kind of, you know, take that away and all the, the data, we can't get the data out and, and then the migration, we, I'm sure we'd lose some people when we migrated and stuff and that, that would be, that, those, those things would be a shame but it's probably, given that we'd have the control, it's probably a better thing altogether. So you know, we'll see what happens, so if you're curious, go have a look at softybaba.net and the other one, the JVlogs from, we don't, I don't think we have a URL for that yet, I'll, when I get home, um, I'll put the URL down below and uh, in the info section if you're curious to have a look at it and come on over and have fun with us come visit and stuff like that and, and uh, yeah hey why not hey and thanks peter for that post it made my made my afternoon now it's time to get some some soda some tea and a beer see y'all later bye bye